Hi everyone, today I want to talk about an issue that I've been having in my personal life. <clears throat> I've not been nice to customers at work. I work in a bakery slash coffee shop. I am a barista there, but I also work front of house sometimes. But as of late, I've not been very polite to customers. Sometimes I am, sometimes I'm not. But the point I'm trying to make is that I've been noticing my conflict in my mind. Oh, I don't need to be nice to these people. You know, I'm so bored, I hate this job, blah, blah, blah. And I'm constantly trying to justify why my attitude and my behavior and my all around energy is just not very nice to people. There are the usual customers that come in and I'm nice to them because we sort of have a relationship and I don't want that them to think badly of me all of a sudden. But when it's with strangers, you kind of, well, I kind of have been not caring so much. And the point I'm trying to make is that I'm not happy with this. I'm not happy with it at all. Um, and for a long time, I was trying, I've been trying to justify my actions by saying it's okay because, or it doesn't matter because I don't care anyway. And because I keep justifying the actions that regardless of whether they're right or wrong, that's up for you to decide. They're not making me happy. And I wasn't seeing that it, that it wasn't making me so happy. And so by looking at does this make me happy or not? I am basically finally seeing the justification for what it is. And it's simply an obstacle to me being happier. That's really all it is. And so this is what I go back to. I'm always trying to tell people, or communicate to them that Tantra, the philosophy that I study, which I don't even see as a philosophy, I just see it as reality. What Tantra says is make yourself happier the next instant. Because when you do that, and you're focusing your mind <clears throat> on doing and thinking things that make you happier. You're focusing your attention towards a better outcome, a better result. And so if you can take this case, I'm at work, this scenario, I'm at work, I'm justifying my negative energy because I don't like being there. And I'm justifying, I'm justifying, I'm justifying. But if I take a step back and go, okay, how do I feel about this? What is my perception? How am I thinking about this? If I question that, I can then really begin to enter this dialogue or this stream of consciousness where I'm focusing, which is basically mindfulness, where I'm focusing on, does this make me feel good? And if it doesn't make me feel good, then why would I carry on doing that? That's a really important question. I mean, you guys let me know, what do you think about that? Do you think that's a good question to ask yourself? Let me know in the comments. <clears throat> Thank you very much. Now I want to move on to something else quickly, which is why I'm making the, these videos. And the reason I'm telling you this now is because I'm trying to reinforce this in my own mind. And that is that I'm making these videos because I want to become a very good communicator to people. I have all these ideas that are filtering through my mind in my life. I've just told you about how that's happening at work. It's happening to me right now whilst I'm filming this video. I'm constantly thinking about what is the right way, right perception for me to have? How can I be happier? How can I let go even more and be ha even more happier by letting go of the things that are distracting me from my own inner peace and happiness? I've noticed that in this video, I'm paying attention now, right now, to am I doing the right thing? Is this making me happy the way I'm looking at what I'm doing? And so I wanna become an effective communicator of how I think about these things. Because I think that we're all doing this. We're all thinking about what is the right way to do something in order to get the outcome that we want. That we want. Because what Tantra says is you're always going towards something that makes you happier. You're already doing that. And I'm seeing that in my own life by paying closer and closer attention to the present moment. So that's my message to you guys today. Pay attention to the present moment. Pay attention to what makes you happier. And try and release yourself from some of the perceptions or ways of thinking that get in the way of you being happier. So that's what I'm doing with this video. I'm making videos because I want to communicate better. That makes me happy. And in doing this process of communicating, I'm paying attention to what's getting in the way of me being a more effective communicator and communicating to people in a way that makes me happier. And doing that means being vulnerable with you. And so I'm telling you a story about something I'm not very happy with in my life behaviors that I have that I don't
particularly like, but I'm doing my best to change them. So thank you for listening, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.